The Gulf War began at 2.38 a.m. on January the 19th, 1991, when two of Saddam Hussein's most vital early warning radar stations suddenly went off the air. They'd been destroyed without warning in a hailstorm of rockets, missiles and heavy machine gun fire, all of which had come from an unseen swarm of ground-hugging Apache helicopter gunships. These machines became known among the Iraqi troops as the Black Death. Now, strangely, the Chinook transport helicopter, the one with the two blades back and front, is faster than this, and so is its Russian equivalent. A lot of civilian helicopters will outmaneuver it, but you have to admit that no helicopter on the planet is quite so devastatingly ugly. This helicopter is uh, the, the Corps commander's best asset. It's the most mobile. We can pop up from behind trees. We can move out from the side of a hill laterally. Then, for hors d'oeuvre, it can serve up 1,200 shrapnel bullets, four air-to-air -air missiles, and 38 rockets. And then you have the pilots who, in this, the Viper Squadron, have a motto, shoot to kill. Our job is to, to go deep as fast as we can, kill as many things as we can, and then get out. 